we're here almost at the Beverly Wilshire. I know, we always go to the Beverly Wilshire. What? It's easy and it's right next door. So we're going there, we're meeting the Golden Jew, and I'd say we're, we walk in, dressed up normal, we get a table outside, we just go inside, change up, go outside dressed up like bears, yeah, exactly. and sit there. That it's bulletproof this way. <laughs> yeah. We don't even have to like get the table. We just we'll just go outside yeah, and exactly. walk around. Exactly. Perfect. <laughs> Perfect. I never thought I'd be a bear. I don't know what that means. You know exactly what that means. Hopefully, I'm a top bear. I still don't uh, know what that means. I love that they know we're filming, and they're like, "You guys filming it today?" And they're like, "Come in. It's awesome." These are the hardest things to walk in. A liberty. What is it called? <laughs> liberty. <laughs> you got to do it. Now for the <laughs> What's for breakfast? I'm hungry. I don't know how you guys are even not sweating your ass off. What the hell? <laughs> I, don't, I don't even want to know. Have some fruit, bears. <laughs> Thank you. Use your claws. There you go. He's double fisted. What the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck is wrong with you, Drake? Like, seriously. We were going to bring a wig for you. No way, dude. It's, I, listen, ones. I understand it's Halloween, but Jews don't get dressed. Are you a female because you have white claws? Get the fuck out of here. I'll stab you with a fork. You guys are fucking retarded. I love how you're still in character. I don't, I don't understand why not. I gave it my old guys. I wish I could eat with my bear outfit on, but that might be pushing it. Not possible. Is that my country bear breakfast? Wow. That, oh, that's man. A country bear that looks amazing. If I wasn't dying, I'd yeah. eat it. Get your eyes off of it. Wait a second. Who are you, the fucking Jerry's kid fucking bear with no fucking feet? <laughs> Who the fuck is this shit? He's got no feet. He's got a fucked up costume. He's got nothing. <laughs> Whose seatbelt's not on? Oh, that's me. Fuck, Papa Bear, let's go, bitch. You have no idea what you're filming, do you? No, I have no Yeah, idea. because you're filming the dashboard. <laughs> <laughs> you're filming the piano black I wood, dude. I see the camera going like this and this, and I'm going, what the fuck is he doing? And he's filming this from the clock to the fucking air vent. <laughs> you don't see bears in Rolls Royces, but only in Beverly Hills. <laughs> All right, so this is what we're doing. We already got the ultimate Salomon VIP experience. Uh, Hollywood Boulevard is closed due to a Jimmy Kimmel event or something or another. Yeah. So what we're gonna do is I'm gonna get out of the bear costume so that I can film this properly, but Farshad and Alejandro are gonna go out here and uh, see what kind of trouble they can get into. So basically the Golden Jew is the bear handler and he's gonna walk around and see how embarrassed uh, Alejandro and Farshad can make him. I can't wait for Juicy to handle my bear. Wait, wait a second. Let's make that 300. What's your bear's name? This is Bear 2, and this is Bear 1. I'm always number 2. He looks like Smokey. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll give you that. Sm I know you want to eat the people, but... You want to do a photo? Picture? No, thanks. He's been dissed twice already. There you go, there you go, yeah! Come on, Bear 2, we got five! <laughs> <laughs> Say hi to the bears! Hi, hi. Tell them what dance moves you want them to do. We got the bears dancing. Hey bears, let's go. There's no money over here. Let's go. Just you said put on Jesus Christ. Let's go bears this way. Shout out to my bears, man. We in the building, man. Only you could prevent for his fire. There we go. <laughs> yeah. The bear two right here. There you go. Oh, no. Oh, bear two. No. Jesus Christ. No. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> and he's walking all fucked up. <laughs> Oh my god! We gotta get out of here before we get arrested! These Chinese people ain't gonna know what the fuck is going on! <laughs> now you can drive an American hustle car. I don't think we're making any money right now. I don't think we are making any money. 
You're the worst bear handler I've ever had. I have bear spray. Cool. You want a picture? Oh, yes. Yeah. Yeah. Go right ahead. Come on. Yeah, just you come, come on. Come you want a picture? No. Take a picture with sister. Come on. Get with your sister. Go, 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 go. There you go. Wave to the camera. We go, bears. Always helping the kids. <laughs> this is not even worth the three hundred dollars. By the way, not even. I wanted to pay three hundred not to do this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, sorry, you got a little action there at the end. Uh, that was amazing. That's the most action I've got in a while. Have people never seen a bear getting into its Rolls Royce? Never. I guess Wait, not. Wait, no, no other bears have Rolls Royces? We failed miserably. Yeah, that didn't go well. We didn't get a single dime. You got uh, you got humped by Farshad. I got humped by Farshad. And That's then you something. immediately took pictures with kids. I don't know what bear abuse, and then some kids jumped into it. I, I, I don't know what's going on. I think I blacked out. So uh, I guess we'll have to check the footage. So we just dropped off Golden Jew. You still have some bear fuzz on your Do I? Chin. On my beard? Yeah. Got Good. It. it was honestly terrible. It was. Like those people, I have no idea how they do it. Different respect for them now. Yeah. It's 93 degrees right now. Get the fuck out of here. Yeah, it's 93 degrees. That was horrible. I was wondering why. He got so hot so quick. Yeah. You know how Tesla announced that they're going to do the autopilot cars and self-driving completely from A to Z? Yep. Yeah, there's no retrofitting my car. Shut up. Oh. Yeah. You can't retrofit yours? Uh, so, again, I got the Salomon VIP experience through Tesla. Oh, my gosh. So right now we're gonna to go to the Peterson Automotive Museum. That's where we're going right now. There's a Bugatti exhibit going on. What are they showing? Because I'm not entirely sure. You're the one who planned this. I'm excited because I love Bugatti. I didn't plan this. No? I wanted to go to the Peterson Automotive Museum, but this event in particular is courtesy of Sir Farshad. Farshad. Okay, so I called my boy Michael at the Peterson and I said, hey, can we come down to have one of our adventures there? And he goes, oh, I got something awesome for you guys. So there's some sort of, uh, like they've collected one of the greatest uh, set of Bugattis in the world at the Peterson. And tonight is a press event, which we're gonna go for them to unveil this exhibit at the Peterson. Oh, so they're gonna have some rare Bugattis. Like because the rarest of the rarest. Because I remember Carter saying, you realize that this is like a collector's dream uh, scenario. And with that said, Farshizel, because you got to 12K and you're at 12, K thousand air, yes. a twelve thousand air, right? Is that yeah. right? Twelve thousand air. Actually, excuse me, sorry. We're a thirteen point five K. Well, well he's hang on. a baker's dozen. I, yeah. I, he's killing it right now. Yeah. But let, but but I think I can do one better. How about if we get you to sixteen K and we'll make a post right now once we get to the museum? Okay. We'll get you in a Bugatti W sixteen. No way. Fuck yeah. Are you serious? I'm dead serious. I'll get to ride in a Bugatti? We'll get, I don't know if barrel? you can drive it, but I can at least guarantee that I can get a Bugatti where you'll sit in and go for a ride. Have you ever been in a Bugatti before? I've never been, and it's a bucket. You know our bucket list. You know the bucket list. <laughs> this is on the bucket list, right? So you want to do that? I would love to do then that. Then get to 16K. Let's go. Let's go. Come on, guys. We got to get to 16. <laughs> no one no one knows this. We never get invited to anything. We only get in because we are yep. car owners. Yep. Yeah. yeah. But the, the second thing that I want to point out is that we are in t-shirts and jeans <laughs> and I guarantee you that this is gonna be just like Monterey a lot of uh, suits and ties well here's the deal I don't care yeah. hey we're, we're, <laughs> I don't I, care. listen we're on the pre we're on the list we're getting in I can buy a, a used Bugatti like a 2006 one if I can afford it at uh, 2006 you're getting a little carried away now <laughs> you can, you, can, you want to pay, pay for that oil change? You, guys, <laughs> you want to pay for that oil change? No, I how much, don't. Let, let no, know, I don't. Let, please let people know how much an oil change is on a Bugatti. $21,000. Hey, guys, the one thing you don't say tonight, one thing you don't say is you don't talk about depreciation. You don't a, say hey, you, you don't. Depreciation is a word that will get you banned from a Bugatti, <laughs> from a Bugatti meetup. You don't meetup. say nothing to nobody, you understand? No, no, no. We'll, we'll keep it very quiet right now. Keep it tight and quiet. We're here. Let's go see some Bugattis and promote the shit out of Farshad. I don't know why, but I guess let's do this. Have you ever seen a Chiron before in person? I have not. This one is my personal favorite, blue carbon fiber. I think you guys might know that I have a thing for it. Yeah, yeah. I, I, love, I love it. This one and too. the red interior, very Chinese to me, but I still love it. <laughs> I, 
You know that's the thing, right? <laughs> I didn't know. Yeah, it, if you get a, a like a white Macan with red interiors going directly to China, China. <laughs> export. It's a long tail Bugatti. Yeah, long tail for sure. You, know, you see, did you see the wood inside? It's got wood more than your boy. Wow. <laughs> more wood than my honor in the morning. <laughs> and here's my Persian, my, my Persian boner pose. <laughs> This is my favorite. I, I don't think I've ever seen a car that looks more badass, that's older. And I, I'm not into classics, but this is one of the most beautiful things I've ever seen. It's so elegant. It's like Batman, like a classic Batman. Does that make sense? Like if Bruce Wayne had a lot of money and knew about cars, instead of buying a Lamborghini, he'd drive this back in the day. You really you really need to put more wings and spoilers on a BMW? <laughs> do, you really, do you really need to? I'll be honest with you. No. I, I, I actually think the spoilers and the, all this stuff is so other drivers can see you coming. <laughs> can you explain to people what is the hate with BMW? I just don't like him. I, 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 I generally no, no, hang on. But like the way we talk to each other, he's like we're friends. Like he doesn't yeah. like BMW, and we just shoot the shit about. It. He doesn't like BMW. No one hates BMW people. Yeah, we're, yeah. This is also, just French conversations. Yeah. And we need we need BMW to succeed. We because want them to succeed. Why? Where else are we gonna get the humor from? Exactly. So I'll like their pictures. I'll support. I'll do everything. Where else, like, like where else are we gonna get the humor from? Because cars unite BMW owners <laughs> against Farsha. <laughs> On a serious note, like a public service note, stay away from BMWs. Every every incident we've had. Every look at look at me in the it eye. It is no, no, no. incident we've had. It is. It is BMW. Yeah. Did you see this? Wow! Wow! Oh, wow! Oh, oh, this is where we're going. Oh, so this is what they're five. this is what they're opening at five. So we have nine minutes. All right. So we'll come back at five. Yeah, we'll come back at five. I love the way they paint the like they painted the old cars. They look so fucking beautiful. No, you need a GT3 RS in this color. <laughs> Rumor has it that this Ferrari has been driven more than any other Enzo in the world. <laughs> We're the first ones getting in, huh? That never happens. No, it doesn't. Were people midgets back in the day? When did people go from being midgets into being giants? <laughs> Is the American version of Bugatti. And he's got an oh, elephant. The spirit of an elephant. It's the spirit of an elephant. So, this is four total made. Yeah. There's only two that survived. Because one got destroyed with during World War II. This is one? Can you see the detail? They made two of these. Five? Of the blue and blue? There's five? Because this is considered a world record edition. Oh, okay. I know, I know what it is now. What? If I get to 16. I'll get you one of these. Uh, I'll get you a driving. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'll, get, to say. I'll get you a, a riding verbal, one of these. Verbal, verbal contracts in California are binding. We'll see you in court. Yeah. <laughs> I think these are going to be legendary cars in the future. You really think so? This was doing stuff that nobody else was doing at night. Back in the day, yeah. This is my people's license plate. Look, I can't read, but it's Farsi. Well, this, you can't read Farsi. I can't read it, but, speak, I, but know, yeah, I, I know that this is Farsi, I think. I'm pretty sure. Uh, I'm pretty sure that that says Bugatti. But, yeah. If I know what it says, it says, see you later. The Prince of Persia and the future Shah of Iran received the striking supercharged Bugatti as a gift from the French government on the occasion of his first wedding. And they, they say first wedding. You have a lot in common with the, with the Prince of Persia. <laughs> Divorces. We're down. We're, we're, we're one to one divorce. Like Bugattis. <laughs> so we were, we were noticing a couple patterns here, which goes hand in hand with Farsha's life. <laughs> Bugatti's first marriage doesn't include like any cool pictures, but if you go to the second marriage, then you see him with horses, cars, bitches. Like he's set. Look how grumpy and sad everyone is during the, the first marriage. And, like, the second, and there's nothing. There's no wealth. There's nothing. Like the second marriage. Papered up. What are <laughs> you doing? Hey, Farsha, do you want to add some Parmigiani to your Bugatti? The CEO of Lamborghini's here. We're, we're, we're gonna get kicked out. We're gonna get minutes. kicked out in two seconds. So we might as well call it a day here. 